All right, time for a little ski RV map exercise. After spending a whole bunch of time in the great state of Utah in Salt Lake City, we uh, finally moved on uh, to the edge of the United States to California. We spent a whole bunch of time going through Nevada during that trip and seeing a whole lot of nothing, uh, a bunch of desert and a bunch of mountains, actually a lot of big mountains before we went to California and hit two resorts there first being mammoth which is a little more southern uh i guess technically central california and then hitting squaw valley uh, near lake tahoe the trip up from um, mammoth to squaw was uh around four hours this says three hours and 37 minutes a little longer for us in the rv we stopped along the way for uh, a dinner break in a uh, park in a small town uh, on Lake Tahoe and then we went all the way up to um, find a spot up near Squaw to uh, park for the night. So actually for the night we uh, did spend a few hours uh, at the train depot in Truckee. It was only about 15-20 uh, minutes from Squaw Valley. Got up early the next morning around 4 so that we could be situated uh, for Aaron and Amanda to start working. We weren't really sure where we were going to park. We found a good spot and we weren't moved. Uh, I slept till I was ready to go skiing and uh, Amanda and Aaron worked on uh, East Coast time. This is the view from inside the Squaw Valley Tram on a nice sunny day. Squaw Valley on a, what is it, Wednesday morning, Aaron? Yeah. Wednesday morning, got the sun out today. We're at high camp. GoPro, stop recording. Like a few of the other resorts that we visited on this trip, Squaw has combined with a, a neighbor uh, resort, Alpine Meadows. We have not or will not be visiting Alpine Meadows on this trip, but it's a little like um, Aspen's uh, four different mountains and um, Snowbird Alta combination. As you can probably tell from the slide, um, Squaw is very large, uh, almost 3,000 vertical feet, 34 lifts, and over 6,000 skiable acres. Uh, we did ski from side to side. The backside was not open for us while we were here, but a lot of terrain, a lot of varied terrain. Um, again, a little, not quite as big as Mammoth, but uh, a lot of variety for various skier types. That's Lake Tahoe up in the distance, if you can see the water. Straight ahead. Once again, Lake Tahoe right in front of us. Spring skiing today. Early February, well, early-ish February. It's a warm one. Aaron says his new gloves are too hot. <laughs> 